welcome back to part three of this modern house, the small modern house, made out of dark oak wood, quartz, sea lanterns, anvils, quartz stairs, and white stained glass and gray stained glass, and a bunch more blocks, including stone too. Anyways, get rid of that. Today we are going to be furnishing this house. So today we're going to start off with the living room. So start off by placing a stair, so where this window is, place a stair right here, one, two, one, two, and another stair. And then we place it, that right there. Then right here, we get, we place a cobblestone wall, just like that. And then put two black wool, two, two pieces of black wool, and then place a button. That's going to represent our TV. Yeah, I know, it does kind of suck, doesn't it? <laughs> but we're going to have to deal with it. It's a very modern design. Sorry, that was one block in front. Okay, I'll just redo all that. Alright, we got a two-foot TV, I guess. So, yeah. Alright, that'll be it for the living room. Now on to the dining room. So, I just got rid of the two main components that we need. So, we need this, and this, and that. Now what we're going to do, we're going to place three. We're going to do that. And now we're going to get this and this. Get rid of those. Get spruce doors because they look best. And then we're going into a lot of detail into just these little doors. Just these little chairs. Then place two trap doors on the side of each. Um, slab, dark oak slab, and then there you go, you've got yourself the dining table. Next, the kitchen. So we're going to have the, we're going to need furnace, crafting table, water bucket, cauldron, tripwire hook, and maybe some chests, if we can even fit them in. Anyway, so first off, you start, oh yeah, and instead of chests, we're just going to use stone slabs. Then you're going to place one, two, three, then do that. Get your cauldron, fill it with water, that's your tap, place the crafting table, and then you know what, just because we can, we're actually going to move this, wait, we probably shouldn't do that. Yeah, I guess we have to just go like that. Alright, so that's our kitchen. Actually, we're going to place the tripwire hook right here because we are going to make the... We're actually just going to do something that really isn't needed on this um, furnace. But we're just going to make an iron trap door go up on it. Why did I do that? Anyways, let's get quartz. And then do this. Place place the iron trap door. Put a redstone torch under it. Then close all that. So now you've got a cool looking design. And then get the freaking chest <laughs> and place it right here. There you go. Now what goes for, that's basically it for the first floor. Now the second floor is going to be a bedroom. So we are going to get, actually we'll make the bedroom and the bathroom up here. So first of all, you're gonna need dark oak planks, wherever, wherever they are. So, I really don't feel like this window needs to be so big. You know what, we'll just leave it there, because why not? All right, anyways. Let's get this. Do this. This is gonna be our little bathroom. So make an entrance right here. Well, actually, this should be the bedroom. <laughs> you 
So I'm just gonna divide this window. So let's see, three. So we'll make this. All right. Then we'll just make a double thick wall, cause why not? Then bring this all the way up. And plus we could add like storage here, for example. Alright, so now we get some dark oak, some of this. So that gives us a cool design in the wall for shelves, say, for a shelving unit. So do the same thing right here. Gone into so much detail on this little house. And then get quartz stairs. And we need a bed, obviously. And then we'll get snow blocks and a button. So that's a little drawer. We'll make let me get my white gloss out. Do this, place a stair. And then maybe, just because we can, a flower pot with a blue orchid in it. Or whatever flower you want. I, pr I like blue orchids, just because they look, because they're, they're my favorite color, blue. You guys didn't know that. <laughs> All right. You know what? Uh, I won't do that. You know what? This could be a cool little feature for this house. I'm running out of little. I'm running out of time though, so I'm just gonna have to use white stained glass. So. So we're gonna place glass behind there. Just like that. Anyways, get back in here. One, two, three. Button, button, button. Button, button, button. And then get this done in here. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. So now we've got this cool theme. It might look bad from this side, but it doesn't look bad from that side. Now, we either we do that or we just copy the design. That looks much better. Because you can like climb to your brother's bedroom, for example, or like how I can climb in my sister's bedroom. Well, not climb, climb, but you know what I mean. And then do that, get rid of all this, get dark oaks, door, place it from the inside, get dark oak door, place it from the inside. There we go. I don't care if we didn't add a bathroom. We're done with this house, period. You could add a little toilet right here if you wanted to. But anyways, that'll be it for this video on how to make and furnish this house. Did I build it one block high? I feel like I did. Let me just check. Oh, that's why. We built it one block high. 
Oh, well, that's fine, I guess. Anyways, I'll see you guys all in the next tutorial. And I'll see y'all later. Goodbye.